Hello, I will talk to you about apopsiopesis. Apopsiopesis is a rhetorical term for a broken sentence. It's a figure of silence, and when it translates into Greek, it means becoming silent. The function of apopsiopesis is to create a dramatic or comedic effect. It expresses ideas that are too overwhelming to finish, and it lets the reader successfully figure out the missing thoughts that were left unfinished by the characters. To successfully set out apopsiopesis and to let the reader know that is what you're trying to get across, you have to use the correct punctuation. Ellipses and hyphens are the correct punctuation to use. Examples of apopsiopesis are not that hard to find if you know what you're looking for. Homer Simpson from The Simpsons uses a lot of rhetorical devices in his dialogue, and he uses apopsiopesis when he is talking to his wife, Marge. He says, I won't sleep in the same bed with a woman who thinks I'm lazy. I'm going right downstairs, unfold the couch, unroll the sleeping bag, uh, good night. The use of apopsiopesis is to create this dramatic and suspenseful effect. We get this vibe from him that there is something he is not telling us. William Shakespeare is a writer from way back when, and he obviously used a lot of rhetorical device. His king, or his character, King Lear, uses apopsiopesis while he, was, he is talking to his daughters. He says, I will have revenges on you both, that all the world shall, I will do such things, what they are yet I no, not, but they shall be the terrors of the earth. Apopsiopesis is used here to create the dramatic effect, and it gives the reader the sense that there is something terrifying and threatening that King Lear will do to get revenge on his daughters. Even though he doesn't know what they are yet, he knows he will do it. And